Hey guys, welcome back to JD's Arcade. All right, today we're gonna play a classic that I know a lot of you have played. It was one of my first five games that I ever owned. This is my original copy, Castlevania. Let's take a look. With its horror theme and rock solid gameplay, Castlevania was an automatic purchase for me when it first came out. I love Universal Monsters, Hammer Horror Films, and straightforward action, so this game has always been one of my favorites. I even picked up the Game Boy Advance version, part of the classic NES series, so I could play it on the go. I was super disappointed with the more non-linear Castlevania 2 where I had to backtrack and go looking for stuff. Thankfully, Castlevania 3 got the series back on an action-oriented track. Brett Weiss, NES Omnibus. A neat platform collecting game that keeps you coming back for more, Castlevania has all the touches that make a good arcade game. Sensibly, when you die the game allows you to start again at the beginning of the current level, rather than forcing you to hack all the way back through again. Plenty of puzzling routes to learn, and there's a small strategic element involved in the collection of extra weapons. You can only carry one, and it's important to have the appropriate add-on at the right time. Advanced Computer Entertainment, May 1989. Graphically, Castlevania is among the best Nintendo games, featuring constantly changing backdrops and many highly detailed sprites. Drop your memories in the comments.